Hi there and welcome to video number four of the AdWords Editor video training tutorial course brought to you by ppccampaigngenerator.com. In this video I want to talk about how to import and export files from AdWords Editor. So you'll first notice that we have a CSV format, a zip format with images, AEA, AES, and HTML. I want to talk about the structure of these and what you can export. So you can export certain accounts, you can export campaigns and ad groups, you can export the specific campaign you have selected, or you can export the current view. So here we are on the campaigns tab and we have the campaign over here selected. If I select the account, what happens is the export current campaign goes away. But if I navigate to an ad group here, we can see all options are available. So the options that are available here are determined by where you are in the navigation tree. So for the most part, let me just give you straight up advice. I always export as a CSV format. The reason is the CSV format you can easily import from a file that you save on your computer or by simply copying and pasting text. So my recommendation is to always export as a CSV. And let me just show you, if I export this entire account, let me show you what that looks like. It's going to open up in Excel and we have our entire account nice and neat in CSV format. So if I wanted to get more specific I could just select campaigns and certain ad groups I want to export, select them, all paused, all active, and then I would just hit OK. Another thing I can do is export the current campaign and that's determined by where I'm at in this tree here or the current ad group. A nice feature here is the export current view. You can export, for example, if I'm on the campaign level, I can export the current view which happens to be on the ad groups tab here. So the view is determined by the data view grid here. So I can go to export current view and this will export the view within the data grid area. In this case it's the ad group tab. Okay. So if I have for example keyword selected and I go export CSV the current view, this should export all my keywords because the current view is on the keywords tab here. And you can see it did Okay, so there's this images in zip format. This is good for image ads, so if you have a bunch of image ads, you can export them in this type of file format. I'll be honest, I don't use this enough, but it has the same features as the CSV. There's this AEA backup format, and this is a compressed version of the export, so if you want to just back up your account, you can export the whole account, current campaigns, ad groups, whatever ones you want to select. Um, this AES, this is for file sharing. So if John and Susan are paid search managers, so John says, hey, Susan, I want to make these changes. And Susan says, OK, send me an AES file format. John exports it, sends it to her. She can import it and see the changes that John's proposing. So that's the idea behind this format. Um, it, again, it's the same thing. You can export the whole account, certain campaigns, ad groups, and so on. But the next thing I really want to talk about is this export as an HTML format. This is extremely useful. I use this all the time because here's a real life scenario. So the things I do revolve around a legal team. I constantly have to get ads approved by a legal team to make sure we're not saying something we shouldn't and to make sure all the trademarks are in the right place within the ads. So what you can do is you can export as an HTML and these file formats are perfect for people that don't know anything about AdWords. They don't know anything, they just want to know the basics and this gives them a nice snapshot of what your account looks like. So let me give you an example. Let's export the account and it'll open 
in your browser because it's an HTML file. And you can see I can expand or contract the campaigns. I can see the ads over here. I can see the keywords we're bidding on. I can see what we're bidding and the match type. So it's really great for showing someone that has little knowledge with AdWords what your accounts look like. Um, another thing you can do, let me show you a quick trick. So if I wanted to just send the ads, not send the keywords, what I can do is copy this campaign. So I did it by control C, hitting control V, and then let's just say I'll put legal review just to make sure I don't confuse the two campaigns. What I can do now is go into this legal review campaign that I just made, cut all the keywords out, so I just have the ads. So with this campaign selected, I go up to File, Export as HTML, Export the current campaign. This will export, and what's nice about it is it just shows me the ads. So legal can look at these ads and either approve them or deny them or make changes and comments in the right here. So it's a really useful format and it's something that I would not do well if I didn't have. So though the file formats you can export, to import you pretty much can import a snapshot of an AEA file or an AES file and you do that by clicking File, Import Account Snapshot, or you can import a CSV from File by browsing to the location on your computer, or by zip, or you can simply copy and paste your account here. So that does it for the import and export files. Um, in the next video tutorials, I'll show you more about these menus and features. Thanks for watching.